My name is Dennis and I am currently studying my second year B.Tech Applied Science. Hi, my name is Elias Ariza and I'm currently studying at Westminster Kingswood College and uh, I pass maths. Um, currently I'm doing my engineering level 3 B.Tech in my second year. My name is Kautu Ibrahim. I study health and social care, I'm level 3 and I'm in my second year and I'm studying that. My name is Louise Zachariah and I study Applied Science and I study Maths GCSE. And my name is Noel Alanga Kelly. I am the course that I'm doing is Level 3 BTEC Health and Social Care Year 1 and I just passed Maths with a grade 4. confident about maths but I did have really supportive teachers so I actually hated maths um, I didn't want to do it again I turned up to pretty much all of my lessons really late um, I don't think I went for the first term because I wasn't bothered but then I knew maths wasn't going to leave me alone so I had to get it done and then I just started revising and going to my lessons on time before joining the college, I didn't dislike maths, but I knew that it was something that I struggled with. But now, after retaking maths and passing, I feel more confident and I know that it's not something I have to worry about anymore. I love maths, like, I really loved maths, but I felt like I was too distracted. But then that's why I, went, I came here, Westminster Kingsway, so I could be away from my friends and for, be more focused. happy and over like over me because I thought I would never pass but I did so I'm in love. A relief because in the sense that it's it's not on your shoulders anymore, it's, it's lifted up and knowing that I passed it shows that I can able to do my engineering course more doable and it's not as hard as I expected before. Like I don't have to do it again. But then in a sense I kinda miss it because my teacher is really good like Motivate, motivated us a lot. Yeah. Maths overall has helped me a lot because in science I do have to talk about diagrams, I need to talk about the statistics, so it does help me resolve many problems. It's, not, it's not an engineering course, so it's, it's the foundation of engineers. So it's more sorts of physics and maths, so you need to be really good at that in order to at least go through it and pass. People around you, the teachers, the resources that you have, the library is always open until late. Um, you have everything accessible, um, so there's no, there's no limitations. The teachers here are really good. They don't baby you in a sense, like they still treat you as an adult. So my teachers would like would push me to for me to like strive and do the best I can. They they motivated me and they really supported me, and I'm just so thankful that they that I had those teachers in my course. give up, be patient. Sometimes mocks the, the assessments in maths you would fail, but that doesn't mean that you're going to fail the whole course. Make sure you do your revision um, and make sure you're dedicated to learn and also you need to have time management. I would say for you to be organised and to be focused and to be dedicated in what you're doing. a lot of people like my friends they say that they're scared of teachers and they don't ask something that they don't know because they're scared to ask them so the teachers are really gonna help you throughout your education I would always say put your head up and always look forward not back 